to follow that big breaking news in Clinton this morning. An early morning explosion igniting plenty of fear in that area. News 8's Ken Pierce live at the Evergreen Trailer Complex with the very latest details. Good morning, Ken. Good morning, Laura and Keith. Two people had to be helicoptered to the hospital. Their home is now rubble. The most amazing part of this is just the power of the explosion that people around here witnessed this morning. Can't see much from here. Let's get right to the video and show you what is left. And there's not much left of what used to be a double-wide modular home. It was Unit 11 of the Evergreen Springs Mobile Home Park. That explosion that did that was felt for miles away. People were calling 911 about the explosion before dispatchers even knew what had happened. Then they got a call about a fire here at the mobile home park. One neighbor tells me he heard a man who lives in that unit screaming for help. The police officer who was first on the scene got the woman who lives there out with the help of that neighbor and a couple of fire extinguishers that he brought over. They were both taken by Lifestar to Bridgeport Hospital. And that neighbor says when he felt the blast, he, his first thought was that a tree fell on his home. I live 150 yards away. I blew my doors open, uh, blew screens out of the windows. It blew the trim off of one window. I mean, everything off the walls. Units even closer than that had windows blown out. There were pieces of Unit 11 in the neighbor's yards, pieces a block away. There were even pieces of that home dozens of feet up in nearby trees. There is nothing left that gives you any idea that that used to be a mobile home. Now, fire investigators are still looking into the cause of this, local ones and state fire marshals as well. Uh, there's no gas hookups in this mobile home park. Everybody's got propane tanks, so that is the leading suspect for what caused this explosion. We're live in Clinton this morning. I'm Kent Pierce. Back to you.